Hello there, it's Steve here. I just want to show you the new folders feature for iOS 4 installed newly on my third generation iPod Touch 8GB. The, not all the features are supported um, because Apple is a bit monopolistic and everything, but I've got a few of the new features and I just want to show you folders. Um, so I'll just unlock it there and show everybody my passcode. Oops, it is. Hold on a moment, bear with me. Now, as you can see, I used to have three app screens. You can't see that here, but at the moment, I have one app screen. I can try scrolling along, but I can only go... I, I just have this, and I have Spotlight Search. And up the top, I have three folders. I have one specifically for the, some of the default applications that I don't really use, such as Clock and Maps. I don't really use many of those often are you have games such as Angry Birds, and Bubble Wrap, Tubes and Magic Sand and I've got uh, Internet and Communication I just call it Internet because uh, otherwise it will look a bit lame and it won't fit in, in everything and these are my favourite apps which I use most often so uh, I've got those outside of a folder so that they're more easily accessible um, now to, if I were to make a new folder what I'd have to do I'd have to tap and hold until they go all wheely and then if I wanted to put contacts or, or rather videos in a folder with photos I press and drag it over photos and that would happen and I can click and drag it down and stick it in the folders together now it automatically names the folders based on which applications are included in the folders in this case it's obviously media applications so it's labelled as entertainment and that's fine if you wish to edit the label name just tap in the box there and you can edit it so I'll call it media done there you go got another folder you can drag folders around I can put that at the bottom if I don't want to use it all that often um, I can put it on an entirely different app screen if I wish to so it's there and uh, once you're finished just tap the home screen button and you're all done now if you want to edit a folder just click on it tap until it goes all wiggly then you can rename it or you can drag an application outside of the folders and if you wish to add another application to a folder just click and drag it over it and it will go inside it now there is a limitation you can only have that's four eight twelve applications per folder but i do believe there is a limitless amount or folders you can have so you can have as many folders as you want containing 12 applications each that's a bit of a pain you see because I have I have loads and loads of games installed and I'd love to be able to have some kind of scrolling feature so that I can put as many applications as I want in a single folder and then just scroll up and down as I please but instead if I wanted to sort them out appropriately I'd actually have to make two folders especially for games which is something I really don't want to do because it will make everything look untidy now to delete a folder what you're going to have to do is drag both applications outside of a folder and then it will disappear automatically just like that and then you're back to how you were originally that's the folders feature of iOS 4 installed on an 8GB third generation iPod Touch. Thank you for watching.